<sighs> hey up everybody just, just got a spare 10 minutes in between rain showers so I'm just going to have a quick look at this passenger side window see if we can do anything about it I'm going to take the door panel off which is done by another screw there there one behind there that'll just lift over and the screws there there and there so that should be fairly simple um, I've even found my um, trim removal tool or something remotely similar. So I'm going to give that a shot. Okay, we're going for it. All cross heads. So far. I forgot, that bit has to come out first. Peg at the top, clips in at the bottom. You need to push a dimple in. Now, fortunately, I've got a dimple pusher to hand. Right. Speakers and top. Right. The Hammer Bridge Al Alcantara Metal Speaker and Tweeter Wood. Ideally, you need to keep this plastic skin intact. It keeps the rain from getting onto the back of the door card. So we need to having said that. All the plastic clips are pushed through onto it, so what we'll do when you get a knife, cut round them. These might pop out, but I don't know how. I haven't got much time before the rain comes back. That's interesting. Bolt just dropped out. 
tall about one. Squirt it. Now we set. Take out my draft suppression kit. I'm going to give it a try. I took the chair, the bottom of the window, the window's gone down. Yeah, that's no fun, eh? Alright, so... I'm figuring that the bolt comes from there. Come from there. There's a thing. It's related or not. We seem to have a broken thing in there. Oh, it's in there. I can do about that. We need some bodger there a bit. Oh, no, that might not be the problem. Yes, yeah, so it won't be helping. That's not a problem. You've got to get the... Get the play in the window. How are they that? Okay. I might just do it. Pop some grease in there. Grease is the word. It's got groove, it's got feeling. Blast everything in WD. Uh, I'm not sure why it's stopped though. Yeah, I don't know about that. Yeah. 
to try and get this bolt back in, I think. Right, well, none of them is particularly tight. So we've got, this must be the window winding mechanism, so you've got four bolts and right. I don't know what it belongs to, but tighten it up anyway something thinking perhaps put the other half in get a tie wrap around it I don't think there's enough room Chance of the work working, do you think? Shove the broken half back in, put a tire up around it. Let's give it a try, shall we? everything and uh, I'll put it back at least we know what the problem is okay all right that's a plan then that's no oh, it's down it's come off already but so much of that idea tied up still on Hmm. Must have wriggled out past it. Right. Okay. Right. I've tried two tire wraps this time. And I'm going to bother it in grease. Uh, put the two halves of the little wheel together, tie them up with a couple of tie wraps. I'm going to blather it in grease and then hope for the best. It's rather tedious if we have to change the entire mechanism for one plastic wheel. Uh, that's even come up with a better idea. Right, so that's what I'm going to do. Um, then I'll put the thing together. 
By the time I finish bothering everything in Greece, I'll be mucky, so I'm going sh- to uh, I'm gonna pop some oil in the bottom of the door as well. Keep the rust at bay. It's probably all I mean. Um, right, so there we go. The window winding mechanism comes out. Take the four bolts out. Um, now with the back doors, you have to take the entire frame off. Um, I'm not sure about these, I haven't actually done one. I've done the back one, I've never done the front one. You have to take the entire frame out. Right, so, right then, that's how it's going to be. So, I'm going to do that now. Before I get mucky, I'm going to say try for now and thanks for watching. See you in a bit. These are the clips which plug into the door. Obviously they always fall off. So I just thought I'd show them. This is on the top of the door as well, so there's clips all the way across the top. And down, there should be missing. There we are. Oh, I dropped it. Oh, that's the baby. Okay, that's all then pop back. Wearing. Wearing. Put the plastic sheet back for press it in as best as I can. Alright. It's not too difficult. And so on. So I'm just going to pop those on. It's not really difficult. Pop the wires back on. Unscrew the two here. And of course the four for the pocket. Alright. That's easy enough. Interestingly, when the window comes up, because of these plastic thingies, which I fitted, there's a lot of flexing in the middle of the door. I think it's windows forcing its way open, the motor's, the motor's trying to come out. So there might be a reason why the bolts have worked loose. I don't know. So because these are the plastic type which fit in the in the gutter. Yeah, little, little metal clips. Which uh, hold them in. Well, basically, it's a window. It's a window glass is holding them in. So it's forcing its way into the channel at the top. So I uh, must explain the, the, the flexing. The little panel comes out slightly. Right. So might be a thing to keep an eye on. Uh, perhaps not bother with the plastic thingies. Anyway, so my problem was a bolt had dropped out, the others were, weren't were tight and uh, I've got a plastic broken, broken plastic wheel on the window runner. Anyway, the entire app seemed to be working for the moment. Um, I've blathered it in grease, I've got, got grease everywhere. Right, so I'm going to pop this, pop this back, go make some tea in my new Hubnut cup, which has arrived. Thank you very much. Right, okay, so once again, see you in a bit.